these are the complete drive assembly mm -hmm. and these two pieces alone weight about two pounds and this one block is an unpack and I could optimize it using metal bracket and it can be just a it can just be a half a pound so I could easily make it down to two and a half pound I really like the portability of it I know it will work but the big question is how well it works and I will find out once the ring stops and that will be five days from now according to forecast this is a proven design I want to modify this design so I can easily implement it on my kayak there are two main parts to this design it's the arm together with the swinging motion and then the fin with the limiter which controls the pitch of the fin my first experiment is to replace the fin assembly with a more flexible fin I have to determine where is the best place to mount this rotating vertical shaft if I mount it in the current position as so the movement of the fin will be more rigid but if I mount it towards the back of the fin the movement of the fin will be more like the tail of a fish I implemented the limiter by a metal plate and a screw the assembly is very compact when compared with these two designs I will not include the arm in my first implementation and I want to see how the fin works if the speed is too slow in my next revision I will add the arm I spent six dollars and bought a pair of crutches at Goodwill store I cut the top section off for the back of the seat it is lighter than PVC and also very sturdy next I cut off two feet long sections and use those as the cross tubing for the metal frame then I reuse the lower section for the pedal drive I recycled the PVC pipe from my old project and use it to rotate the shaft and have a screw going through the hole on the aluminum pipe and then mount the footrest using two hose clamps I added another screw here as a stopper and you will see how I use it later I bought this from eBay and plan to use it as a mast step for my kayak and now I can use it for my drive I cut a block of wood and drew a 1 inch diameter hole on it and then I mount the flange on it this will create a rotation support for the pedal drive I will be able to test the pedal drive in three days. I will post the result as soon as I can. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up or give me some feedback. Please subscribe so that you will not miss my next upload. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.